In 2014, Labour led the successful campaign for Scotland to be part of the United Kingdom and to defend working people from the austerity that would inevitably come with separation. The union of the United Kingdom is based on the principle that we pool and share our resources across the four nations to everyone's benefit and that cooperation between nations is far superior to competition and conflict. In 2017, our Labour manifesto opposed a second referendum as unwanted and unnecessary and said we will campaign tirelessly to ensure Scotland remains part of the UK. We can see the mess caused by the prospect of the UK leaving the four decade long union with Europe. Imagine how much more disruptive it would be to break our three centuries long union of Scotland within the UK. Last year, Richard Leonard, our Scottish leader said, we want to be absolutely clear to the people of Scotland that there is no case for a second independence referendum. We just had a referendum in 2014. We think that settled the will of the people of Scotland. I want to endorse the statement from our independently elected leader of the Labour Party in Scotland. As we said in our 2017 manifesto, Labour opposes another referendum and the turbocharged austerity in Scotland that leaving the UK would cause with the inevitable threat to thousands of jobs and livelihoods. That is not because our society doesn't need to change. It does, and badly. Almost a decade of austerity has left our public services on their knees and Brexit has damaged our economy and divided our communities. The future is uncertain, but another independence referendum isn't the answer. More nationalism, more uncertainty and more division isn't the answer. We need to regroup and rebuild to reassert our shared values of fairness and respect and to remember that we can achieve far more together than apart.